Coming into the season, Treg said he was unsure if he'd be back in Athens for his final season. As a fifth year senior, he could have transferred to another school and he would have been immediately eligible. Naturally, he said he had quite the decision to make. Yeah, I mean, the season was so tough that, I mean, I think naturally you just always look for a way out, you know what I mean? I mean, it's, it's tough when you're, when you're in a bad situation, you just want to find a, a way to get out and get to a new situation. For a guy that's played at two schools and for three different coaching staffs, starting over is nothing new. Trey hasn't been in a lot of situations because of timing more than anything else where it wasn't survival mode for pretty much everyone in and around the program. Transitions, uh, transition to Southern Illinois, transition here, you know, just, it's always been a constant state of flux for him and it's hard to develop like that. It's hard to flourish like that. So with the option to leave and start over once again, Seti met with Ohio's coaching staff this summer to discuss his future. They um, just wanted to make sure that I wasn't going to be a problem uh, this year. Last year was a tough year for everyone and myself personally. I uh, just had a tough time really kind of getting acclimated to coach's system. Well, when we had the meeting, I thought it was 50-50. He'd walk out of it saying, I'm done. It's not always easy to hear what needs to be heard. And the message was pretty blunt with him. I think you've got to change. After I talked to the coaches and stuff, I kind of realized that uh, that I could do it. I had confidence in myself that if I just put the work in and kept my mind right and just did what I was supposed to do, that I'd be a good, uh, a good player for this team. Said he heard that message clearly, so he went to work. And he worked harder than he ever had before. I shot 55,000 shots during the summer. Um, my goal was to shoot 25 during the summer. I got to 25. Uh, thousand and then um, I wanted to get the 50,000 before the season I ended up getting the 55,000. That work has already paid off. First and most obvious is his shooting. You look at his shooting percentages and they're just up drastically, particularly his jump shooting. But I think the other area is his patience in the paint with the basketball. He slows down with it and uh, really has turned into a pretty good playmaker. Uh, whereas last year it might be a forced up shot from a bad angle over a guy. This year it's more likely to be a jump stop, a shot fake, dropping it down to the floor to a teammate for an open layup. Even with the improved play on the court, Seti's biggest impact on Ohio may not be till after he leaves. The most significant thing that Treg can do this year is help establish a culture that he'll recognize when he comes back in Alumni Day in 10 years. That might not be the most exciting job he has. It may not be the most personally gratifying for him right now, but I can tell you that in 10 years, if that does indeed happen and he's coming back around, he's going to take a great deal of pride in it.